some areas of dense fog this morning, though there are places that are waking up with mostly clear skies. Look at visibility right now. We have visibility less than a mile uh, through Burlington, Racine, Kenosha now up to about a mile and a third there. So patchy dense fog this morning where we are at at this moment. We do not have the dense fog. However, we did run into it as we were driving along the highway. So keep that in mind as you are heading out the door again this morning. Some places are waking up with clear skies. You're still able to get a nice view of that full hunter's moon, Tom. Haha, <laughs> hunters, right? Not harvest. Anyways, taking a look at what we have going on. We are dry across the area right now. <laughs> I love how that came over. Anyways, we do have some rain showers uh, just off to our south in Missouri. Those are actually going to work their way towards us today. And then we do have more showers with a cold front back off to the northwest. that will come in by early tomorrow morning. Taking a look at your future forecast, we'll time it out. Again, those showers to our south bump in as we get into this afternoon. Now, this model in particular, I will say, this is the HRRR, is bringing the showers the most and also the earliest or the most widespread shower activity this evening. Most models, though, keep most of this moisture off to our east. I will say just be prepared for the chance for showers starting about 3 o'clock this afternoon, but we'll have a much better chance coming as we head into tonight. 6 o'clock, you can see more of the rain, still a bulk of it off to the east, but then this cold front develops and it'll work across the state and actually move in now between about 3, 4, and 5 o'clock as we get into tomorrow morning. So looking at some big changes in the timing, no longer in the afternoon, we'll see those storms in the morning tomorrow and then scattered showers and thunderstorms throughout the day on Wednesday. But that again is what is coming our way today. It really won't be that bad. We'll go from mostly sunny skies to clouds this afternoon, highs near 70 degrees, showers and thunderstorms tomorrow, then colder temperatures and likely widespread frost by Friday morning.